Residents gathered at the corner of Northern Lights and Old Seward here in Anchorage to protest that decision. HB 17 is bipartisan-backed legislation that would have required insurance providers to cover up to 12 months of birth control at a time. Representative Ashley Carrick of Fairbanks sponsored the bill and released a statement after the veto was announced, saying in part that code HB 17 would have made great strides to reduce abortion rates, prevent unintended pregnancies, and allow women in our communities to have autonomy and freedom in their health care decisions. The organizer of today's rally also speaking on the purpose of the protest. Birth control is not controversial. Birth control is not political. And we as Alaskans all believe that everyone should have access to health care and that one man shouldn't decide for all of the rest of us what health care we have access to. In response to a request for comment from Alaska's news source today, Nate of Governor Mike Dunleavy's office, a spokesperson for the governor, said that, quote, Governor Dunleavy supports the First Amendment rights of all Alaskans. Dunleavy also said earlier this week that his veto was because contraceptives are readily available in Alaska and forcing insurance companies to provide a year of birth control is, he says, bad policy.